Hey guys, it's Rosie. Welcome back. Today I'm we are going to DuPont State Recreational Forest to go mountain biking, so let's go there. Put your, your right foot over, over the handlebar. Okay, Rosie. If you scratch, you see. What? I'm good enough. Hey, Mom. I'm sorry for all the noise, but I have to explain exactly what happened yesterday. So yesterday was a really bad day, one of the worst I've had in a long time. Um, because I crashed, of course, as you saw. I don't know how good the footage was. I haven't, like, gotten up the courage to actually watch it again. So I was going, and I hit this loose rock, and, um, I went over the handlebars forward, hit the ground face first, like, whacked my head on the ground, and my bike flipped over and landed, like, on top of me. So, it's really fun. It was really scary actually, like after for a half hour at least, I was like crying and I couldn't breathe straight because I was just like, you know, shaken, very shaken. And yesterday I didn't feel so bad. I mean, my hand really, really hurt. Um, I will go over all of my injuries, but I had to actually walk out two miles on it because we were on the whole big loop. Um, with my hurt knee and everything. So let me just go over it. So I hit my nose, you can see it's like blue and it hurts when I touch it or like scrunch my nose or anything. Um, also my neck hurts today, which it didn't hurt yesterday, but I'm pretty sure it's like a muscle tenseness just on this side. So that's probably my worst complaint today. Um, I have bruises everywhere. I have a scrape on my hip, um, which is also very painful. Um, giant bruises down my thighs, um, my right knee is all, like, cut up and bruised, and then there's my hand, which, it hurts when I move these two fingers at all, or put any weight on my hand, you can't really see, but it's kind of swollen, just moving my hand or knuckles at all just really hurts, um, my family doesn't think it's broken, I don't think I broke anything, um, or seriously injured anything. It's just very painful. I had a hard time getting out of bed this morning and we've been just, we're on vacation. We're in North Carolina, so it's kind of not a great thing to be on vacation. And um, I don't know, we've been trying to like walk around and stuff and it just really hurts. My knee gets stiff if I sit for too long and don't stretch it out, but it hurts when I try to move it. So. I don't really know what's going to happen. I'll definitely try my best to keep you guys updated on everything. Hopefully I won't end up having to go get x-rays or anything. But yeah, so that's why yesterday was a very fun time. I was uh, originally going to do like a review of North Carolina's biking trails, which I guess I'll do that now, even though my opinion will probably be kind of swayed. I'll try to just judge on the first part of the bike ride. Um, so the ups that we went on were not that fun. It was pretty rocky and moody. So I did walk most of that as did the rest of my family. But then when we were going downhill, um, this loop was really nice that the up was not very fun, but the downhill was pretty flowy and just kind of what I liked. Um, later on in the loop, I started to get a headache. Um, because it was pretty hot out, so that wasn't fun, and that's probably why I ended up 
um, like falling because I was tired and just not feeling fantastic. So, I don't know, the end of it kind of reminded me of like Slick Rock and Moab with um, just like a bunch of rock faces that you're riding down. Um, I actually almost hit a tree like a few hundred feet before I crashed. So, there were a few like twisting turning sections. I did like the downhill most of the ways, but the uphill was not my friend. I mean, it's normally like that. I'd say on the rank of like Sedona, Moab, and um, Kingdom Trails and North Carolina, I would say I like Kingdom Trails the best, then probably here, so then North Carolina, then Moab, and then Sedona. So yeah, um, I hope you guys found that information useful and I mean I will let you know how I'm doing later on I just want to say like my entire body hurts so yeah we'll see how I'm doing but yeah make sure to check out my Etsy shop at Rosie Revolts to buy one of these necklaces follow my social media at Rosie Revolts to keep updated on how I'm doing and um, check out my book, getoutdoorsbook.com, and I will see you guys later. Bye!